Hey Pyros, Valmir here at Elite Fireworks and guys, we are going to do an unboxing and showcase of the Diablo Park 1. So we will do Diablo Park 2 in a later video. Still pretty awesome, so 6 minutes of show, you get all of these cakes, so it's a mix of 200 and 500 gram cakes, but the showcase of today's video is Diablo Park 1. Now, majority of these cakes, matter of, fact, matter of fact, all of them, we do sell them in store beside these two. So technically, if you wanna buy these 10 cakes, we sell them individually, but of course, going with a box kit, you save. And what I love about this is basically a bunch of amazing 200 gram cakes from Pyro Diablo. Now, if you don't know Pyro Diablo, I know not a lot of companies carry them, but as you know, here at Elite Fireworks, we specialize in quality, so if there's good stuff, obviously we are, we want to get them for you guys. And of course, we've been getting a lot of positive feedback because of course it's awesome quality. Now, unlike the Diablo Park 2, this one, you are getting more cakes, but it's all 200 gram cakes and it says 10 minutes show. But realistically, guys speaking, you can, if you want to light them all, we do have quick fuse, so you can have this be a minute show rather than have it 10 minutes, but most of the time, 200 gram cakes, you don't do a finale, but it would be a good option actually. So let's open the box. So let me just check also on the back. So it's the same packaging. So not as much details besides telling you that it's a 10 minute show. All right, so we are in. And of course, because these are not designed to be a box kit of its own, rather than it's kind of like an assortment of uh, 200 gram cakes of course you are getting because they everything is not the same size so you are getting an amazing styrofoam also you get another one so definitely let's put these away now we're gonna start off so these are the bigger cakes so all four of these cakes we actually sell them in store as well now if you're wondering price point wise this is uh, 194 right now here at Elite Fireworks of New Hampshire. And if you are wondering if this is going to be available in Texas, yes, I do know that even for over there, like typically there's orders that we place uh, of Pyro Diablo and especially Pyro Diablo, it's a lot uh, less common in Texas than it is here. But anyway, so this is Pyro Diablo's Neon Eagle, nine shot. Uh, this is a little bit of the performance, but we are going to show you the actual performance of this really soon, but you can always pause and read over this. And then if we look at in the, like the detail statistics, so this is nine shot, 20 seconds, eight out of 10 scale, uh, as far as like loudness, it's going to be just ver vertically. So it's going to be straight up medium height so you're looking at something at around 100 to 120 30 feet i would say or it could be as low as 90 90 feet really but anyway uh each company they do have different weights of they me they do measurements so something that's eight out of ten for pyro diablo might be like a six out of ten with a different brand or like it could be a nine out of ten right so uh it's very intriguing to see what different companies and how they uh, label everything but anyway guys let's go ahead and see Neon Eagle so up next we got kick ass forever another nine shots so detailed statistics i'm not going to repeat them just because they are going to be very similar if not identical since like i said these cakes specifically they are designed to be very similar and the ones that we'll see in a similar size so these are going to be similar as well but this is kick ass forever another nine shot this this is the performance details of course this is the one section that it is going to be a little bit different since it's not the same cake, but let's just go ahead and see Kick Ass Forever in action. <laughs> so 
third cake we got it here, Neon Goblin. Again, the detail statistics. Oh, I went on the wrong site. So same thing, nine shots, 20 seconds, eight out of 10 noise, approximately the same height. So here's the performance. It's going to be gold tail to blood red with blue and orange dahlia. Finale of red, blue, and orange dahlia with uh, cry crackle effect. So let's just go ahead and see Neon Goblin. Up next, we got Croc Bite. So nine shots, this is the performance here. So red palm trees with green strobes. And then you're gonna have green palm tree with red strobe, so it alternates. Uh, blue palm trees with silver strobe and a finale of three effects. So I do wanna see what the three effects are gonna be. Same thing, noise level, eight out of 10. So you'll notice all of these cakes right here, they're having very similar noise levels. So I don't really, I cannot really say one is a lot louder than the other ones. Like if you, if you guys have seen, for instance, our H Sound Madness, that is louder. But of course, with this ones, like they're very similar and pretty solid noise level. But, let, but anyway, guys, let's go ahead and see Croc Bite. So we are done with four cakes so far. So those are the four cakes that we have just seen so far. That's approximately half of the cake, uh, the case I would say, just because we cannot forget we did have the styrofoam and of course now four cakes here. So inside here we are going to have eight cakes. So let's start with the medium size. So this one actually I have not shot in person yet so I'm excited for this one but this is Fast and Furious from Pyro Diablo, 16 shots, noise level, so again, uh, it's eight out of 10, so I do wanna see if noise level, they are similar, because typically, you know, different cakes have different noise levels, but it seems like it is a staple to label everything eight out of 10, but anyway, guys, 16 shots, 25 seconds. Now, with this one, based on the details here, we are gonna expect a fan style effect, so rather than just going up vertically, it's fan style. So height, medium. So based on the side though, I would, I would assume this is 90 to 110 feet or so. I would assume these four right here go a little bit higher. But anyway, guys, let's just go ahead and see Fast and Furious from Pyro Diablo. All right, up next, we got best in fields. Now this cake specifically, we do not sell it individually in store. So if you wanna try this out, of course you have to buy the Diablo Park One assorted box kit. So with this one, same thing statistics. So eight out of 10, 25 seconds. So as far as durations, you'll notice all of them in the same size. So we assume this is gonna be eight out of 10. It's gonna be 25 seconds, 16 shots, but the effects are different. So let's see the actual effects. So if we see, this is gonna be a lot of crackling tails, which of course, usually if there's a tiger in the boxes, most of the time there's like some sort of tail effects, right? And then you're gonna have uh, glitter, strobes, willows, and stars. So anyway, guys, let's see best in field from Pyro Diablo. Up next, 
you guys get the message. It's going to be 25 seconds, 8 out of 10 noise, 16 shots. So in a way, it does make it very easy because on here you're getting a lot of the same cakes. So it's, it makes it easier so you know what to expect. But the effects, of course, different. With this one, you're getting willows, shrove, glitter, and stars. Let's go ahead and see pound for pound. Now, I forgot to mention, but pound for pound, this is actually the second of the 12 cakes that we do not sell in store. And same as Best in Field, which we just saw, this one you have to buy the box kit in order for you to try it out. So this is the second and final cake that we don't sell it. All right, so this is a new cake here at Elite Fireworks. So this is go hard or go home. So 16 shots, here are a little bit of the performance details. Yeah, 16 shots, it's gonna be 25 seconds, eight out of 10 noise. This is our, these are the effects. So anyway guys, let's go ahead and see, go hard or go home. just to recap these are all the eight cakes that we have seen and guys I mean so far I am liking what I'm seeing with this uh, Diablo Park 1 assorted box kit don't get me wrong when it comes to Pyro Diablo you can never really go wrong just because especially when it comes to 200 gram cakes I think they make some of the best ones in the market as of right now but anyway guys we still got four more so let's just go ahead and see now these are some of the classics. Okay, so we got Retrosaurus, we got T-Rex, we got Spinosaurus, and of course we got Mr. Rex. Now, with each one of them, the performance is gonna be the same. So you are gonna see all of them. Nine shot, 18 seconds, eight out of 10 noise. So I'm very intrigued because I kind of wish with the labeling on the loudness, they were a little bit more accurate just because I have shot many of these before. Uh, and they don't sound the same so I don't understand especially because they are 200 gram cakes uh, why this is labeled 8 out of 10 and something like croc bite for instance it's labeled 8 out of 10 because they do sound different but anyway guys either way let's just go ahead and see the first one so Mr. Rex Up next, we got Spino Spinosaurus, so same thing. These are the effects, so your nine shots, 18 seconds, eight out of 10 noise, but these are the performance here. So with this one, you're getting brocade crowns, willows, and a mix of different color variations. Let's just go ahead and see Spinosaurus. Second to last cake, this is T-Rex, similar to Mr. Rex, but a little bit different uh, effects. So with this one, you're getting a uh, mix of different uh, effects, but mostly focusing on dahlias with a mixed variation of crackles, shrubs, and so on. Anyway, guys, let's go ahead and see T-Rex. Last cake, we got Retrosaurus. So nine shots, this is the performance. So I guess we are ending it with this one. So let's just go ahead and see this one real quick. There you have it, Pyro's 12 phenomenal 
cakes in my opinion but of course I want to ask you guys what did you think of each of the cakes I know in a video you can't really tell on the noise level but you would have to agree with me that I don't think all of them should be labeled 8 out of 10 just because at the end of the day they don't sound the same there are some that definitely were louder than the other ones but other than that guys let me know your feedback in the comment and we'll see you guys in another video right here on our channel bye bye